Let's tackle one of the harder ones in section 4.2. How about number 69, the integral of 1 over the square root of x times 4 plus x uh, dx. Uh, so this is on page 426. Here we go. Now, in thinking through this, you've got to remember that I'm, I'm just advocating one way to do it. So there may be a better way to do it, but the first u I might try, I might try 4 minus x. Well, the du would just be dx. That's, that's not that effective for taking care of that piece. You could make this your u, but then your du uh, would be a fractional power of x. Won't take care of that. Hmm. 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 Well, what things do I know that somehow have a term times a square? It comes to my mind that I know that the integral of 1 over 1 plus u squared du is arctan, or tan inverse, of u plus c. So, uh, you, might, you might consider that. Uh, Hmm, could we, could we manipulate this in such a way that that would happen and that this would somehow be our du? Okay, well, I can sort of see my way clear to do that because this is square root of x squared, but that's not a 1. So let's, let's work at making that a 1 for a moment. To make that a 1, I suppose I would need to divide that by 4, which would mean multiplying the whole thing times 4 in the denominator times 4 divided by 4 would give me, let's see, 1 over 4 root x and then here I have 1 plus x over 4. But remember my plan to take over the world is to write this as something squared. So why don't I write this as one plus the square root of x divided by two squared. So the square root of x squared is two. Sorry, the square root of x squared is x and two squared is four, so that works pretty well. That would make a decent choice for du be square root of x over two. du would then be, let's see what we have here, we have, I'll, I'll just pull out that one-half, I'm thinking about this as being one-half x to the one-half, so then times one-half x to the negative one-half dx, well that means du, ah, this is looking promising, is one over four square root x dx. Man, oh man, I'm not even going to have to add in any fancy stuff. That works well. That's my du. So I get the integral of 1 over 1 plus u squared du, which is equal to arctan of u plus c, which we'll just sub in for u. Hey, hey. That's how they're supposed to work for us.